there's only one place to start really, Josh. Um, some that try up at the end. Oh yeah, no, I don't know. Um, a little bit of luck. Uh, obviously, Zach, Zach passes the ball and sort of looks up and there's a bit of, bit of space. I didn't, didn't think I was going to manage to, to gallop all the way in, but but thankfully I did and, uh, and finished the game off. It seemed like nice. halfway you you had that second burst. Was that the fans like cheering you onto the try line? Quite possibly, yeah. No, I was. Uh, I, was, I think I was scared of, uh, of losing the ball or, or, or managing to, to, to screw up our win. Um, so I just wanted to get over the line and, and put the ball down and end the game, really. <laughs> <laughs> how was it with fans back today? Because obviously we could hear it in the stands how loud it was, but was it a bit weird? How, how can you describe that feeling? Oh, it was amazing. Like, uh, I walked down through town before the game um, from a flat like I always do, and there was just a bit more of a buzz um, uh, than there has been for, for over a year now. And then that sort of as you get to the the stadium, the the, the, uh, the stands are filling up, it's, it's amazing um, and you could hear the crowd throughout the game um, and then right at the end, uh, it's, it's amazing, it's just great to have them back, uh, really love having them back. Champions Cup rugby secured and of course a lot of boys going out on a high, how important was that to secure first that European spot and then send them course on a high? No, absolutely, um, you know, our motivation for, for the last couple of weeks when we knew we weren't going to make top four has, has sort of all been around the guys that are leaving. We, we've got a great group of guys that are that are going to move on uh, on at the end of this season. It, it's really sad, but we, we wanted to make sure we finished on a high. And, and like you say, we want to be playing in the, in the top league in, in Europe, um, and, and that's what we managed to do. And we'll, we'll send the boys off well now. For you, how do you sum up your season? Obviously, Scotland call up in February, uh, kind of put to bed because of concussion. But now you've got a busy summer to look forward to. Yeah, no, look, it's. Um, it's been up and down for, for the team and and, and for me, like I, I guess I judge success on, on how the team's doing and, and what I can do to help the team. Um, and so it's, look, we ultimately we want to be further at the table and, and we want to be looking forward to a semi-final next week. That, that's not going to happen. Um, and then like you say, yeah, massive honour to get into that Scotland sort of set up and now I've just got to, got to stick my head down, work hard and, and try and fight and, and get my place in, in that squad for, for the summer now. Um, but really looking forward to the opportunity. And then rest up and come back next season stronger and hopefully push up the table. Absolutely, yeah. No, we, we can't wait to sort of have a bit of time off and then crack straight back on um, and, and really push on with this team. And, and next year, the, the youth that's coming through, I think we've seen it this season um, when, when guys have been, been given a shot, they've absolutely stepped up. And I can only see that being a, a positive going into next season. Congratulations on your season and uh, good luck this summer. Thanks very much. Cheers.